Hey, my royalties. It's your girl Naomi, and I'm back with another banger. And I say that because every video that I drop, every video my kids drop, it's gonna pop, okay? So click that like button, that subscribe button, because we popping. And we ain't stopping till we reach the top. Y'all heard me. So, y'all, I know I've been absent for a few days and not posting. Mother Nature came around, and y'all know how Mother Nature be, okay? She had me down. She said, girl, you gonna let down and rest. I was trying to press through it, y'all, but oof, y'all know how that be, okay? The first few days are always the worst, okay? But I'm feeling um, better. I'm getting my energy back. You know, the pain is going away. So that's a good thing. You know, I can start back vlogging for y'all, okay? But uh, today, I'm gonna be making some glazed uh, honey salmon bites with some asparagus and brown rice. Okay, we keeping up with the healthy meals. And I know y'all wanted to see me do more cooking vlogs, y'all. So here I am with another cooking vlog for y'all. Okay, but yes, um, let's get straight into it so y'all can see how I came up with this healthy, delicious meal. This is my first time doing my salmon this way. Okay, y'all. So yes, let's get straight into it. Oh yeah, y'all, I almost forgot to say I want to give a special birthday shout out to Miss Yolanda. Happy birthday to you. May God bless you to see many, many more birthdays. Thank you so much for supporting the channel, for watching and always commenting on our videos. We truly appreciate it and I just wanted to wish you a happy, happy birthday and sending you love and hugs from me and my family to you and yours. Okay, so yes. I wanted to give a special birthday shout out because by the time this video drops, it would be Miss Yolanda's birthday, okay? But yeah, let's get straight into this meal because we're ready to eat and chow down, okay? <laughs> okay, royalties, these are the seasonings that I had used on the salmon, ground turmeric, Old Bay. I, you know, I started uh, putting ground turmeric in all of my food. Um, I put co complete seasoning. I also put Tabitha Brown seasoning. Very good garlic, all-purpose seasoning. Has garlic, black pepper, and lemon in it. I put some paprika in there. I sprayed the pan with Pam, original, you know, non-stick spray. And then I drizzled, before I seasoned it, I drizzled some avocado oil onto the salmon. And then, you know, I got the sock-eyed salmon from sam's club y'all okay some of it did not come out right when i rinsed it some of it did but yeah they're supposed to look like this okay i ain't no chef i ain't perfect with it but you know it's still edible it's still gonna be good okay and um yeah for the most part most of them came out right when i cut them and everything but it was a few of them when i was trying to take the skin off that it had messed up on. So if y'all have any tips on how I can, you know, how it's easier to take the skin off without messing up the salmon, then let me know the tip because I messed up on these right here. <laughs> but yes, then we're gonna um, put it in the oven on uh, 400. Um, I wanna say, I wanna say 10 to 15 minutes, but this is my first time doing this, y'all. So, you know, I'm gonna check on it. You know, I'm gonna say 10 to 15 minutes and then I'll let y'all know exactly how long did it take. Royalties, the oven has preheated to 400 degrees. So we're gonna go ahead and put this into the oven and let it cook. Okay, royalties, the salmon bites are done cooking, y'all. This is how it looks once it's done. Okay, it don't look too bad. It don't look like I messed it up that much. <laughs> now we're going to go ahead and cook the sauce, okay? In this pot, y'all, I got the brown rice cooking, as y'all can see. It's almost done, okay? I'm going to do my asparagus in that skillet. And right here, I have the butter melting. This is for the sauce that we're going to put on the salmon bites okay so this is three tablespoons of butter okay once that melts down let me start because look it's already trying to melt okay once that melts down we're going to add some soy sauce minced garlic and some honey y'all that's how we're going that's the ingredients we're going to use to make the sauce and then we're going to drizzle it over the salmon bites okay 
Okay, royalties, now that the butter has melted down, I did two tablespoons of minced garlic. I'm gonna go in with some honey, okay? Um, I did, I'm not measuring it, I'm just eyeballing it. Okay, that should be enough right there. And then we're gonna put some soy sauce in there. I have never tried it this way, y'all. I seen a recipe and I said, okay, let me try it. Put a little more honey. Cause I like more honey than soy sauce anyway. And then you just want to stir it on low and let all this cook together, okay? Hopefully it should be enough to put all over the salmon bites. I might add just a tad bit more. The rice is about done cooking, so I'm just gonna turn it off and let it finish that way as well. I turned it off, so gonna let that water cook down in there. And you just you don't want to uh, heat this up too high, y'all. Put it uh, like right there, okay? That way it won't burn. You don't want your sauce to burn, okay? Let me see. You just want to let stir all that in, let it cook in there, okay? Not too long, though. I can't wait to see how this is going to taste, y'all. It smells good. Okay, royalties. Last but not least, we are going to put some avocado oil in the skillet, okay? You just want to drizzle that in. Let me turn the stove back on. All right, and we're going to cook the asparagus. I had seasoned and marinated my asparagus with Creole seasoning, um, complete seasoning, and I let it marinate in the fridge for like 20 minutes, y'all. And once you do this, it's gonna be really good because that seasoning is gonna stick to that asparagus, and once you cook it down, it's gonna be busted. So, let me go ahead and put it up in here. I'm holding my tripod and trying to cook y'all at the same time. All right. Ooh, look, it ain't even cooked yet, and it's looking good. Okay, let me know. Do y'all marinate y'all vegetables? Okay, this how it looks. The bag looks, but definitely try it, and then put you a little lemon juice in there as well. Okay. Okay, I'm finna uh pour the sauce on top of the honey bite. I mean the salmon bite. I said honey bites, <laughs> and I did it in this bowl, y'all. That way it can lock in there sauce you know and rocking that flavor until the salmon bites look how that's looking royalties yes so you just want to shake that toss that up real good you uh if you want to thicken your sauce you could put a little cornstarch in there if you want to thicken it up well shoot it's looking good to me let me shake this up some put it on in the top there we go All right, let's see. See how we looking. Ooh, voila. It's giving juicy, okay? It's giving flavorful and seasoned, period, okay? Y'all, the kids finished their food before I could even show their plate, y'all. So, obviously, it was bussing, bussing, huh? Look at that food. Yes. They, they didn't leave nothing but the sauce behind and a little bit of rice. They was chowing down while I was cleaning up in the kitchen. <laughs> oh, that was so good. It was good? All right. It was good, baby, y'all? I wish I could. I wish when I grow up, I wish I could cook like mama. All right. You will because I'm going to teach you how to cook good like that, okay? And I don't when I grow up, I know how to fix Mama car. <laughs> okay. Me too, I go and fix Mama rainbow car. All right. <laughs> Here go my plate royalties. I had sprinkled some, I mean, I had drizzled some of the honey onto the rice, y'all. That's why it looks like that. And that is the salmon bites and my asparagus, y'all. I tasted the asparagus, asparagus and it is so good, y'all. Okay. Definitely seasoned to perfection and tastes well. <clears throat> And I give my, um, I give it a 9 out of 10, y'all. The only reason why I don't like doing cooking videos so much is because I'm not good with putting it on the plate. You know, with presentation-wise. But I promise you, my food tastes good. And everybody who tried my food, they know 
all my recipes, all my meals be busting, busting. I just, busting. yes, it's just, I can't put it on the plate and present it how the chefs be presenting it. Like, you know, professional wise, but when you taste it, but, you ain't even gonna care about how it look, uh, how it's plated up. You just gonna be like, oh yeah, this is good. <laughs> Here, royalties, let me give y'all a bite. Then y'all go take y'all bite. And here goes some asparagus, okay? Mm. Bussin. Bussin. But I told y'all, <clears throat> I told y'all I was going to stay eating healthy. And I have been exercising, you know, before Mother Nature came along. Um, but I can't wait till she leaves so I can get back to fully exercising how I want to, okay? But, um... I'm so proud of me. I'm staying consistent so far. You know, and I'm feeling a little lighter. I'm not feeling as, um, you know, I feel like I lost a little weight, you know. And I just feel, you know, much better. I have a little more energy and stuff, you know. So, I'm going to keep on eating healthy. Keep on showing y'all the healthy meals that I'm making, that I cook for me and my family. And, you know, the kids are loving the food that I make. They loving the vegetables. Um, you know, one day I made them uh, for lunchtime on the weekend. I did a peanut butter sandwich with some blackberries and raspberries. Oh, uh, yeah. Then I did a pickle and I uh, diced up some cheese, y'all. Okay. And they liked it and they ate it all. Okay, so that was a good healthy lunch. And then another snack idea for them was cucumbers, celery, and cheese. Okay, I diced it up. They ate all that. That was good. So, you know, just trying to uh, incorporate more healthy snacks, more vegetables. You know, all that good stuff into their foods and to mine so we can be healthy and get our vitamins. Okay, but yeah. I'm going to finish eating. And I'm going to get back to y'all because I don't want my food to get too cold. But if you try this recipe out, let me know, y'all, okay? Oh, what's your favorite type of word? <clears throat> Hold on. <clears throat> this seasoning. <clears throat> but what's y'all favorite type of way to make y'all sound? Let me know in the comments, okay? I'll be back to y'all in a minute. Y'all, I am full from that meal. It was good, okay? Delicious, healthy. You know, I cooked it good and everything. Um, Now that I've tried the wild-caught salmon, I see, you know, I taste the difference in it, y'all. So, you know, I'm, I'm definitely going to get the wild-caught more often now. But it was good. And as y'all can see, the kids enjoyed their meal. So that was pretty much it for this cooking vlog, y'all. Stay tuned for more. I'm also going to be uh, making another cooking vlog soon. Uh, I'm going to show y'all how to make keto pancakes. It's just another healthier way to make pancakes, you know. Uh, I'm going to show y'all all the ingredients for that. You know, all that good stuff. I'm going to make it on the channel with y'all. Let me know if y'all... Um, have tried keto pancakes before. I'm not fully keto, y'all, but I have been trying some of the keto recipes and they've been good so far. So, you know, um, I've definitely been liking them and everything and, you know, just trying to stay consistent with eating healthy and everything, you know, um, and losing weight. Cause you know, I have a, a certain amount of pounds that I want to lose this year, okay? So, you know, when I set goals, I like to complete them, okay? But yeah, y'all, if y'all new to the channel and y'all want to see more cooking vlogs, hit that subscribe button, turn y'all bell on so y'all get notified every time I post a video. Um, share it to your friends, to your family. Come watch this cooking vlog and come subscribe and join the palace, okay? I know y'all like when I do cooking vlogs, okay? So let's get this video to 600 likes, okay? Smack it, smack it, smack it. So that, um, you know, YouTube can push it out and more people can see the video and more people can watch it and join the palace, y'all, okay? Uh, but I know that my shopping videos, those shopping videos, y'all love those the most. I think it's the shopping ones, then the cooking, then the day in the life videos. And I see that y'all like the laundry videos as well. Um, that laundry motivation video, that one did well. So I definitely want to do more videos like those also. Um, but yeah, let me know what other type of content y'all want to see from me. And yes, y'all, thank y'all so much for tuning in, watching, and supporting. 
uh i know that this video wasn't too long like you know the rest of them be but stay tuned y'all okay i got more long videos coming soon for y'all all right i pray that y'all have a blessed night a blessed day and i will see y'all in my next video bye y'all peace peace out peace <laughs>